Hey guys, so today is just going to be a few tips and tricks on your um, pool sand filter if you're using a sand filter. I'm using the sand just because it's a little easier for me to backwash it and rinse it rather than take the whole, if you have a cartridge filter, taking the whole capsule off and rinsing the filter and all that. So um, basically on the sand filter, you basically you got three main settings that you'll use. You use the filter, which is what it's on right now, filtering the pool, which you can see just kind of giving it a nice swirl around. Um, and then it has the backwash, which is what you use when you rinse the sand out. Uh, and then it has rinse. So I'm just gonna kind of do a couple steps process here um, to clean the sand. Do you wanna turn the pump off first? One of my tips whenever it comes, and this is gonna go to backwash. Let it just backwash for a few minutes. Um, one of my big tips when it comes to the sand filter on the head of it, around the top, is you wanna always go the same way whenever you're changing it from filter to backwash to rinse. So you never wanna take the head down and turn it to filter and then turn it this way to rinse and then turn it this way to backwash. You always kinda of wanna go in the same um, same area there and I'll show you why. So on this one, you really won't be able to see it, but I don't know if I can see it with my glasses on, but there's a gasket in between the top of the head and in, inside the head. And whenever you take this down and you go back and forth, back and forth, it bunches this O-ring up in here. Um, so that's why I always suggest going the same way with it. I typically always try to backwash for just a few minutes um, until you see this, the water coming out of the end there until it's um, cleaner than what it was when it started. Now my stand's gonna give me a few fits. Hold on a second. Stand you back up. <laughs> Maybe, hold on. Malfunction, malfunction. My ground is not very level out here. Okay, here we go. So after you let it backwash a few minutes. My hose is spraying water. I don't know if you see that or not. I'm turn it to rinse now. Let it rinse. Now typically you want to let it rinse, there's a little side glass here, so typically you want to let it rinse until you see all of the sand go out of that side glass there. Whenever it starts back up also, I'm going to check the skimmer basket uh, of the pool up in the skimmer up there to make sure that there's no leaves or bugs or anything like that getting clogged in it. One of the biggest tips I have when it comes to the sand filters um, is after you backwash it and after you rinse it, you wanna, so whenever you have it rinsing and you turn it off, turn it back to filter and then let it set. Don't turn the pump back on yet. Let it sit for about five or 10 minutes. Cause right now in that rinse cycle, all of your sand is swishing up and down in that can. And if you turn it off and you turn it right back on to filter, it's gonna, all that sand that's moving around in the can is just gonna squirt back into the pool. So if you let it settle for a few minutes, that'll let that sand kind of settle down and then it will have no problem coming out. I think my skimmer's starting to suck a little bit. My water level's low. I need to put some water in it too. While that's doing that, we're gonna pull this out. I'm gonna leave this one out because I have a new basket. This was my basket from last year. There's not really anything wrong with it other than it's really dirty. And I could probably let it soak in something and clean it. So while that's setting, I'm gonna go get my new skimmer basket to put back in there. So I don't wanna mess with that one anymore. Put some water in it. Just a few tips and tricks. So I'm gonna let that sit after rinsing for a few minutes. Let that can sand kind of settle down in the can before I flip the power back onto it. That eliminates the sand going back into the pool is basically what's that doing. Um, we get my vacuum started too, cause I got a little, little stuff in the bottom in there. I don't know if you can see it or not. There's a glare on my glasses. But anyways, most of my videos have been for hot tubs. This was just one for pools. Um, I will have more coming up on the different um, things about pools. And I've got more coming on hot tubs also. So stay tuned. Have a good day.